I want to make uh, this video. Um, I don't know if it's out of concern. I don't know if it's out of desperation. I don't know what it is. But what I do know is that I was just driving down the street and um, I saw a park bench with a couple of uh, Jehovah Witness women sitting on the park bench. And it looked like they were just in a subtle conversation. I saw, uh, I guess, what you would call literature on one person's lap. And a feeling of gloom came over me. I'm very empathetic as a person. I just, I, I, I know I seem like I come off as really aloof and, you know, I, I'm not. I really, really feel bad for people in, in a lot of situations. I'm one of those type of people that, you know, I'll, I'll see something on the street or I'll see something in a person, pain, mental pain, anguish, whatever you want to call it, hurt. Um, and I'll just, I'll, I'll feel bad for them to the point where it's like, you know, I feel like crying sometimes. And that's the feeling that, that I, uh, I felt just now because it was like, what are you doing? What, what are you doing? I mean, if you really feel wholeheartedly, uh, uh, you know, a Jehovah witness that's supposed to go out and preach the good news and there is so much good news attached to this organization and in life and paradise and the great crowd and sheeps and resurrection and, you know, all of the good things. Like, wouldn't you, like, I don't know. I, I You know, these are one of these videos where it's like, it's it's just going. It's just coming as it's it's as it's going. I don't know what to say. It's just I see two women sitting there, and it's like I don't know what to think. There's no anger. There's no. It's actually sorrow. And this is not the only two people that I've seen. I've seen. I mean, they occupy these park benches. I don't see them approaching people. Excuse me, excuse me. I don't see that. Maybe in other territory, maybe in, in other cities or countries. I don't know. I, but I haven't seen it. As a matter of fact, I've walked past people that I know are Jehovah Witnesses. I know them. I see the literature. They walk past and, and they don't say anything to me. They don't stop me. Excuse me, sir. Sir. Hi, hi, hi. Did you hear the good news? And I'm not talking about the lottery. Did you hear the good news? Like I'm passionate about like what I do or what I say or what I stand behind. I'm passionate. I, I have passionate discussions with people every single day, you know. And if I saw someone in person and they spoke about something that I posted or something about God or spiritually, I don't care. I'm going to like, yes, because this, that, and the other, I'm passionate about what I believe in. And I'm just looking for that passion. I'm looking for that energy. I'm looking for that happiness. You know, I, I, I just see people, you know, slow strolling down the street and it's like and you know and I feel bad I've gotten to the point where the anger and the not the anger but cuz you know I don't I don't want to give them that much credit but that feeling is towards the 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 governing body the people that run this organization I'm really starting to feel sorry for these these groundkeepers, right? 
I'm really starting to feel bad because it's like, I mean, it, it, this is it. You do this and then you 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 perish like everybody else. It's, you know, if it if, listen, if it brings you happiness, who am I to judge? Who am I to say anything? But it just doesn't look that way. It doesn't look that way. If you're going to do it, then do it. Stop people. Right? A Mormon will not let me pass them by unless they're already talking to somebody else. Or unless, like, I got headphones on and I'm jogging and I got this look on my face like, don't bother me. But if I'm just casually walking by, they're going to try to stop me for the most part. Right? They are in these, like, really uh, distressed areas and neighborhoods for a reason. They ain't there to just walk by people and just, you know, have the uh, uh, possibility or the risk of getting shot, robbed, or kidnapped. Right? For no reason. It's like, nah, we here to talk. And I'm just looking for that. You know what I mean? And I really felt sorry for these two uh, JW women. I, I really did. I drove by and I looked and I said, oh, man. And this is not to try to be funny or anything. It's not. It's not. I just wish that you can spend your whatever years you have left, like just being happy or at least looking like it. As always, you know what I ask you to do? Think. That's it. It's love.